Hi everybody, it's Tamalee, your local Tampa Bay Realtor. I'm here with James Serrano from Pino's Palette in Wesley Chapel. I am so excited to be featuring this small business. I have participated in a couple of his um, instructor-led painting classes and they're super fun and it's a great time to have. So I just wanted to introduce you so that you guys can know a little bit more about James and where he's from. Um, James, can you tell us a little bit about yourself? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, originally from Queens, New York. Okay, hey, in the to, house, I Queens moved, house. That's right, that's right. Uh, so moved to Florida, I wouldn't say now almost 20 years. Uh, have this business in Wesley Chapel. It's been here for going on six years now. And I now live in Wesley Chapel, close to the business. So uh, we're happy to be here and, and continue to be here. Oh, fantastic. What made you decide that, you know, you wanted to open Pino's Palette? What inspired you that this was the type of business that you wanted to bring to our community? Sure, no problem. So my background is not in art. It's something completely different. Uh, financial services is my background. And, uh, you know, it just came a time when we felt, you know, let's do something completely different. And one of my good, good friends had something very similar. And I said, man, this is fun. Because I went and I painted and I drank wine. I drank a lot of wine. <laughs> and I thought it was like the coolest thing just to relax. And it, it was very therapeutic for me just to kind of listen to music, have some wine and, and paint. And I thought, man, this is going to be something cool. I want to do this. Mm -hmm. Not knowing anything about art. So my game plan initially was open a studio, have artists work in, and then go back to my normal business, which is financial services. As we opened the studio, I fell in love with it. Uh, and what I fell in love with, just connecting with the community. I fell in love with bartending. Uh, to be honest, I've never ever cleaned the toilet in my house, but at the studio, I have a lot of pride and passion. I'm the guy that cleans the toilets. I like to bartend. So it just connected me to the community. And I just, I stayed, I stayed working here. Um, again, the plans were for me not to even be here. So uh, I'm happy to say that a lot of the artists that have started with us from day one, most of them are still here. So retention has been strong and uh, it's just, it's been amazing to see something just grow from, from nothing to all of a sudden the community knows who we are. Uh, we're very involved with the community. In fact, in 2017, we won Best New Business of the Year. Uh, that was extremely exciting. We give back. So yeah, it's been, it's been amazing to be a part of the community. Oh, that's so fun. I love that. I love that story that, you know, you thought that this was going to be kind of like a side hustle just because you enjoyed it. It was a hobby. And then it turned into what it is today. And I'm sure that has to do with all of your efforts to stay involved with the community and giving back. And, you know, you've made quite the name up for yourself and the business. And I think that's why yes. you continue to be um, prosperous and successful in our community. So thank you for that. Um, can you tell us a little bit more about um, I know that you kind of gave us a quick synopsis of what you can do there, but of, you know, the type of events, um, what you offer. And if just in case of nobody has never heard of Pino's Palette of what it is that you do, can you kind of just talk to the activities and what takes place when you visit your Pino's Palette? Absolutely. Absolutely. So our tagline is paint, drink, have fun. So we actually have a wine bar and beer bar at the studio. You come and paint, so we have an artist giving you step-by-step -step instruction on a, on a specific painting. We, and in between step, there's music playing. So the combination of music, having a glass of wine, and painting, it's, it's very therapeutic. Uh, so in addition to our public classes, we do a lot of private events. We do a lot of birthday parties for kids. Uh, we do a lot of summer camps where kids come during the summer and, and paint here. And not just paint, but they do crafts. So it's morphed into summer camps. It's morphed into a lot of events for, for kids birthday parties, we do bachelorette parties, we actually travel, so we go to locations. So it's not just here at the studio, we go to hotels, we go to universities, we just go wherever we're needed, we basically recreate the studio. But, but the main concept is painting here at the studio, primarily on a, on a canvas, we use acrylic paint, but we've morphed into painting on wine bottles, painting on wood palettes, uh, so we've expanded, even doing blankets. We call them the chunky blankets. Uh -huh. People love making blankets. I never thought people in Florida would love that, but <laughs> it's, it's been a home run. So, so that's kind of like our main, main business. Of course, with the changes with everything that's going on, we've had to recreate ourselves. And all of a sudden, we have a completely different business that we have to learn literally on the fly. Mm -hmm. And tell us, is that some of your virtual classes that you're conducting now too? Yeah. So, so basically, as every small business owner, you know, Late March, 
the world all of a sudden changed, right? Mm -hmm. We went from, we had just renewed, renewed our lease for another five years on March 10th. And on March 11, it's, you know, it's oh, declared yeah. a pandemic. So we're thinking, oh my gosh, what do we have to do? All of a sudden we have to close our studio. And, you know, it was, it was scary, right? Because you're thinking this is a gathering place, number one. And it's also a non-essential business. So I got the double whammy. Uh, so we started a brainstorm and thought, hey, there's something we can do. And we thought about, hey, let's do virtual events where basically we can still have the class, but everyone's at home painting with us. We started doing painting kits were include on your canvas, your paint, your brushes with written instructions. So a lot of moms, parents were coming to the studio, curbside, picking up their painting kits with instructions and then taking it home. And then we started the virtual classes, which basically you register, you come pick up your painting kit here curbside, or we actually even deliver. So I've been competing with the Amazon drivers, trying to <laughs> get in front of them. And uh, so I'm basically the delivery guy. I'm the guy that takes your painting kit to your doorstep. So we morphed into deliveries, uh, virtual classes. I'll show you quickly the studio. Um, I don't know if you can see from there, but so we have cameras, we have lights. So it's almost like it became like a Hollywood studio. <laughs> I, don't know if you can, I don't know if you can see from there when I'm Yep, nice the see little stage and where you have the camera set up so that people can follow along. Yeah, so people basically register. They either come pick up their painting kit here curbside or we deliver it to them. And then it's a live class. So the artist is on stage and you're at home painting. Uh, mm -hmm. it's, 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 it's definitely a completely different monster. From that, we morphed into doing private events because a lot of parents would say, hey, you know, my daughter still wants to have their birthday party. What can we do? So we've been hosting private painting parties where the mom pick up, picks up the painting kits, gives them to their guests or arranges to have those kits delivered. And then the kids still have their party just virtually painting. And then of course they have their, 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 their complete product at home. So that's been great. Uh, we, we've started, we have like four or five events already booked uh, this next coming month. And of course, Mother's Day is right around the corner. That's typically our bread and butter. That's our Super Bowl, Mother's Day and Valentine's Day. This year is a little bit different because uh, no one's gonna be here at the studio. Everyone's mm -hmm. gonna be painting at home. Um, and then for Mother's Day, uh, we basically, see me okay? Now I can. We, we, um, we, we partnered with my friend Cam, he's the owner of Strat 360, and we donated painting kits to the nursing, uh, oh, wow. to the healthcare workers at Advent Health. So that was just a way for us to say, on behalf of our community, thank you so much for what you do. So a lot of nurses and healthcare workers will be painting uh, from, you know, we donated the painting kits to them. So that's kind of like our way to say thank you to our community on behalf of us, you know, here you go, um, healthcare workers. Oh, that's so amazing of you. Thank you for doing that. I'm sure that they appreciated that. And it's, like you said, it's therapeutic. It's a way to escape and just have fun and, you know, relax and enjoy, um, you know, an artistic form to kind of, you know, exhale and, you know, take a moment for yourself. But I love Absolutely. that yeah, I love, love, love that the virtual has gone really well. And I'm sure that once we, you know, we can um, congregate again and come and come back to the studio, I'm sure you, there's going to be tons of people who are going to want to get together and just socialize and paint and all of that. So I look forward to that in the next couple of weeks and months to come. Um, yeah, absolutely. And I, and, I, and I should add, so this has opened up doors where we never imagined we would be doing deliveries or mm -hmm. virtual painting parties, but a lot of people actually like that. There's people that just want to be home, whether yeah. regardless of quarantine, they want to be home. So our plans for the future long term is to have our classes here at, still at the studio with the music and the wine and the beer, but also give that customer the ability to register and participate in the classes from home. Oh. So I'm actually working with someone that's gonna come and install professional cameras. So you'll have the option to say, hey, I'm painting at your studio or I'm painting at home. So we're excited about that. It's something That'll new to fun. us, we're working. So that's gonna be, uh, I think, uh, a great thing to add as a, you know, as an addition to what we do. No, I, I think it's fabulous. Cause if you're having a birthday party or you're having your bachelorette party or any type of an event or gathering and somebody because they're out of town and can't participate or anything, they can still be present remotely and everybody can still have a good time and, you know, celebrate together any occasion. So that's awesome that you could do it both in live in the studio and follow along. So yeah, no, absolutely. And we've, we've seen how this has connected individuals. I mean, we've had folks, we've done deliveries to Puerto Rico as someone wow. called me and said, Hey, um, you know, I saw, I guess she follows on Facebook because she 
she's been to our studio when she comes to Florida and she said, hey, we, we, we're bored here. Can you deliver some painting kits? And we deliver kits to Puerto Rico. We've delivered to other states. Uh, we have a, someone today painting from, I think, New Zealand. How that, uh, cool. she's, got some, she's got some friends here and they're going to paint virtually. So it's been a way to really, even though we're isolated, it's kept us connected. Yes. So us, anytime I have to do a delivery like that or, you know, or, or hear that someone's painting, you know, from out of the country, it's amazing that, oh my, my we are coming together still in our ways, you know, in, in different ways, of course. No, I love that. I love that you can, you know, still do that and connect people from anywhere and everywhere. So amazing. Um, can you let us know what's the best way to get in contact with you if we wanted to yeah. you know, for a future event or if you have any upcoming um, virtual classes that we can register? Yeah, absolutely. So the best way is really to go to our website, which is pinospalette.com forward slash backslash Wesley Chapel. The reason for that is that's where you see the calendar and you see the pictures of everything we have scheduled. And it tells you if it's a virtual class, the time of the class, or it tells you if it's a, a painting kit with written instructions. We have also recently added uh, painting kits with recordings. So let's say if you don't want to do it live because 7 p.m. doesn't work for you, mm -hmm. you can actually register and you have the recording for that painting. So yeah, you go register online, you buy your painting kit, and then you have the option to say, hey, I want this delivered or I'm going to pick up curbside. And then you just meet us here at the studio and we bring it out to you. Uh, you can, of course, call the studio 813-428-6590. We're happy to place the order for you. But I would say 70% of our customers they just go online, register. And then like right here, our artist, Britt, she's working behind the scenes of putting the uh, painting kits together. <laughs> you guys can see but, you know, we come in the morning and start getting all the painting kits together from deliveries and then folks come to the studio curbside and then we just bring it out to them. Oh, that's awesome. Fantastic. Well, I want to say thank you so much for your time. I love, love, love all the offerings that you're currently doing and will continue to do so. And I just want to thank you. And if you guys are interested in learning more or scheduling um, a virtual painting class or you wanted to contact them for a future event, please visit their website. I will be including it in the links um, when this goes live so that you can go visit their page, see what they're doing, check it out and pick a date so that you can paint. Thank you, James. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Well, thank you. I appreciate you so much. All right. Thank you so much. Have a great day. And I appreciate this opportunity to speak to you. Thank you, James.